In a recent video here on Personas' channel, I showed you how you can connect Apple AirPods directly to Studio One so you can mix directly to, for example, your AirPod Pros. With version 6.6 .6 of Studio One, we've now made that even better. I'm talking about Dolby Atmos. So here's the situation. You've got a Dolby Atmos mix. You listen to that in Apple Music on, let's say, a pair of AirPod Pros. What happens? It sounds different here than it does even if you're listening directly out of the Dolby Atmos renderer on the AirPod Pros. Why is that? Because Apple has its own proprietary binaural renderer. That means the way it sounds, even on the same headphones coming out of the Dolby Atmos renderer, will be different than how it sounds coming out of Apple Music. Up until now, the only way to solve that problem was to render the song, put it into Apple Music, and listen to it there. Not anymore. The Apple Spatial Audio Binaural Renderer, say that five times fast, is now available inside of Studio One as a separate monitoring output option inside of our renderer. What does that mean? It means now within Studio One, without ever leaving Studio One, you can hear exactly what your Atmos mix is going to sound like in Apple Music. As with most things in Studio One, it's real, real simple. Open up the Atmos renderer and come over here to the output section and simply change it from Dolby Atmos binaural, for example, to now Apple Spatial Audio. They do sound different. This was a much needed addition. Oh, and by the way, you don't have to open the renderer to make that change. You can do it right here within the little renderer track. Just come over here and change it right there. Two quick things. First, Apple Spatial Audio is only available on Mac OS Monterey or later. There's no Windows support for this feature because it uses some under the hood Mac OS stuff that's not present on Windows. Secondly, this update adds support for head tracking and personalized headphone profiles if you have compatible Apple headphones. Whether you're a seasoned Atmos mixing pro or you just want to dabble and tinker, we've made it a whole lot easier with this update in Studio One version 6.6.